<laughs> Probably noticed a lot of folks wearing red today, That's and right. it's more than just a fashion statement. That's right. Anne Marie Tiernan is here to tell us why it's so very important. Anne. Yep, we're all wearing red, and it's not a coincidence. It's because today is National Wear Red Day. It's a part of the American Heart Association's month long campaign to help raise awareness and money to help prevent heart disease in women. Naomi Peskovic explains why this month and that mission could save many lives, including yours. Lifting and rolling. Brandi Kersey's job at an Indianapolis warehouse proves just how far this 23 year old has come. Every single day. Though she had a long family history of heart problems, she never thought as a young woman her own life was at risk. I couldn't really breathe. I couldn't sleep at night. I couldn't stay asleep even if I went to sleep. Brandy was diagnosed with an irregular heartbeat and went in for a procedure that fixed her heart and changed her life. I just, I want more to better myself. She knows the doctors can't do it all for her. So she's working out more, eating healthier, taking steps as simple as bringing her own lunch and small snacks to the office. I plan this year to literally lose about 30 to 50 pounds extra than what I already have off. For 57-year-old Tina Brennan, the mission is awareness. All you can think of is, this is not happening to me. Tina was at work at the Simon corporate offices downtown when she had a heart attack. I had just come back from a small vacation with my daughters, uh, and it's literally, as soon as I sat down at my desk, I felt this overwhelming nausea. The mother of three was in shape and healthy, which is why she now shares her story and message with all of her heart. I, I preach to every woman I know, they'll all tell you, don't ignore the warning signs. When you don't feel well and there's something uh, th that isn't right, it means there isn't something right. There's something wrong. Having a healthier diet is one of those easy decisions we all can make, starting at the grocery store. So while you'll be seeing a lot of red, the hope is you'll also choose yellow and green for a healthier heart this month and always. Back to you. All right, Naomi, thank you. And there's lots of ways that you can join in and support this Go Red movement. From donations to joining heart disease research studies, we put it all together for you at a link at WTHR.com where you can get involved.